Hey guys, welcome back to my life. I am currently on my way to trial a horse because I found some horses I can ride for free, which is good because the reason I stopped riding well, it's because of how expensive it is. But I put out a thing on a Facebook group asking if anyone wants Izzo, like, will let me ride their horses. <laughs> and I've got a few responses, actually. So I've got, like, three trials planned for the next, like, three days. I've cut my hair short since I last rode. Actually, I rode once with my hair short just for another trial that didn't end up working out. But um, I've managed to sort of put it up into a little bun, but it's, like, <laughs> not really a bun. But anyway, I don't tie my hair up anymore. At this length i just use claw clips but obviously you can't really use it under a helmet but anyway we're just gonna see how it goes i'm also struggling right now to figure out what music to listen to so yeah that's a problem anyway bye okay i just got home for two different horses basically the lady just like wants like them to get more exposure i can take them on trails and stuff like that so i'm not sure if they're both getting sold but i think one is i guess she just wants like it's good to get more ladders on them. Now I've got a helmet here. Hey guys, welcome back. I just trialed another horse and he was so chill and small, which is what I like for horses. And I think I'm definitely gonna ride him quite a bit and then the one I tried yesterday I think I'll ask them if they uh, prefer just doing like weekly trails or something like that some clouds started rolling in and I wanted to go have a look and I've just been driving around and um, I found a spot to stop now so yeah I'm just kind of watching the lightning which has actually kind of slowed down a bit I got a notification from my weather app saying that I'm gonna get heavy rain in, in my location soon it's not heavy yet. There was a big gust of wind before. That's when I got back in my car. And I want to go over to that little shelter over there so I can sort of be out in it a bit more. But Google isn't really telling me if I'm safe from lightning under a small shelter like that. Also, now it's sort of starting to rain heavier. <laughs> okay, update. The windows are closed now and I've got this on so I can still see. Yeah, I don't know. I might go because the lightning is kind of like boring now. It's just rain. I hate when there's lightning. Like, I love lightning, but... I kind of hate it because that means that I'm like, I'm, oh, <laughs> that was a big one. Because <laughs> it makes me scared to like go out and play in the rain. Like I want to go out in the rain, but I don't want to get struck by lightning. I know it's really, 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 really unlikely, but I'm still scared. I think I'm going to head home now because I'm scared of lightning. Also, I cut my hair today. As you can tell, I've just had my trial ride of the third horse slash horse riding area, like people's horses, you know. Um, I think the second one I'm going to ride the most and then this one is going to be like two times a week. And then the first one, I'm just going to tell them like, hey, like I can not ride very often, but I can like come out on trails and stuff. I'm really glad that I'm going to be getting back into riding more because I've missed it. And the reason I stopped is because I got a bit scared of it because I was didn't really have horses I felt confident on, but these ones I do. And also because of the money, but these are all free and cheap. Okay, I've just moved to a spot where there won't be people driving past me every two seconds watching me vlog when I'm literally just trying to ride their horses. <laughs> but anyway, I've got to finish explaining. So, so I went on a trail ride, which is scary for me sometimes, like depending on, well, because it's rocky. Like I hate, I get really scared when it's rocky and steep, mostly steep downhill. Uphill isn't too bad because downhill I'm just scared of tumbling. Like it's like further to fall, you know? Like you'll just roll down the hill if you fall off. Like I just have a fear of the horse like taking off or tripping. So I haven't been on many trails. I went once with my friend Malia on one with one of her horses and I actually did fall off once partly on purpose because I was just like freaked out because she started the horse started running up the hill and I was like scared because I was like ah like I'm gonna end up like who knows where either that or it's gonna be steep after the top of the hill downhill and I'm gonna like tumble like the horse was just trying to get up the hill I was just scared so yeah that's the problem like I'm scared of horse riding but it's also one of my favorite things to do. But one thing my friend Malia did tell me while I was on that trail with her was you just need to relax on the horse because the horse is trying to figure out what to do. Like the horse is trying to move where it thinks is the best place to move. That like it might need to speed up 
to get up hills. It will speed up down steep hills because you know when you're like trying to run down a hill and it's hard to stop because like you sort of just build up the momentum and you just sort of have to let the horse know where to go. And I know that that's common sense, but what I was saying to her, I just sent her a video like as soon as I got to my car, I was saying to her that like it is common sense, but when your brain can be anxious, it doesn't listen to common sense it listens to its own version of common sense which it creates which um actual common sense is the horse is just trying to go where it is going to be easiest to walk and you're pretty safe like yes bad things can happen but it's not certainly going to happen like it's not like a huge risk when you can be scared of riding or things in general like your brain creates its own version of common sense which is like that rock looks like the horse could slip on it if it stands on it but the horse knows where to walk most of the time like the horse you gotta trust the horse like that's what i have what i struggle to do but yeah i trusted the horse today and she did not let me down and she made me feel very comfortable and yeah i just was doing my best to relax it was also bareback which helps me because like I actually prefer bareback because I like sometimes for like trails and stuff because like I, if I need to it's easier to get off so yeah I had fun I actually almost did get off at the end because we went back the same way that we came and I thought I remembered there being like a steeper part that would have been scary to go downhill but it actually wasn't that bad like I, I was like oh can I get off and then the like instructor lady she was like no nah, you'll be fine like it's not that bad and then it wasn't that bad. Like it turns out my brain was just sort of mixing up a different part of the trail with the beginning of the trail. So it actually wasn't that bad because that's what your brain does when it's scared. Like it creates its own information and that's a problem. But anyway, I had fun and I think I am going to ride these this horse more.